Insidious is an American horror franchise created by Lee Wannell and James Wan. This movie franchise is one of the best choice for those who love to watch horror movies. If you haven't seen the Insidious movies yet, it's far better to watch it in the upcoming order. So let's begin. The first movie you should watch is Insidious, Chapter 3, released on 2015. This movie is a prequel to the first two films and the third installment in the Insidious franchise. Elise Rainier is an old woman who has had a paranormal gift, one that lets her see dead spirits and demonic entities. She is a brilliant parapsychologist, working as a paranormal investigator, taking clients via phone calls. When teenager Quinn Brenner senses that her late mother is trying to contact her, she seeks help from gifted psychic Elise Rainier. However, Elise's tragic past makes her reluctant to use her abilities. After Quinn is attacked by a malevolent entity, her father pleads with Elise for help. With support from two parapsychologists, Elise ventures deep into the further where she finds a powerful demon with an insatiable craving for human souls. Watch full movie and see what happened next. The second movie you should watch is Insidious, The Last Key, released on 2018. This movie is the fourth installment in the Insidious franchise. When a client, Ted Garza, calls the parapsychologist Elise to ask for help since he is haunted, since he moved to a house in New Mexico, Elise refuses the request since the address is the same house where she spent her childhood because she has nightmares with her childhood in New Mexico, where she lived with her brother Christian, her supportive mother Audrey, and her father Gerald, who frequently beats her when she claims that she sees ghosts everywhere in the house. However, she changes her mind and accepts the job, and travels with her assistants, Spex, and Tucker to New Mexico, where they will discover an evil entity in the house. Watch full movie and see what happened next. The third movie you should watch is Insidious Chapter 1, released on 2010. This movie is the first installment in the Insidious franchise. A married couple, Josh and Renai, have recently moved into a new home with their sons, Dalton and Foster, and their infant daughter, Callie. One evening, Dalton sneaks into the attic where he encounters a mysterious entity. The next day, he inexplicably slips into a coma. Three months later, with no results at the hospital, Renai and Josh take Dalton back home. The family starts to experience frightening paranormal events. However, Josh's mother Lorraine calls psychic Elise Rainier and her paranormal investigators. Elise explains that Dalton is not in a coma. He was born with the ability to astral project his consciousness and had been unknowingly doing so in his sleep, believing he was simply dreaming. This time he has traveled too far and has been captured in a purgatory dimension called The Further, a place inhabited by the tortured spirits of the deceased. The only way to rescue Dalton is for Josh to go into The Further and save him. Watch full movie and see what happened next. The fourth movie you should watch is Insidious, Chapter 2, released on 2013. The film is a sequel to the 2010 film Insidious and the second installment in the Insidious franchise. Soon after their showdown with evil spirits that possessed their son, the Lamberts, Renai, and Josh are ready for their lives to return to normal. However, something still is seriously off, especially with Josh, who, unbeknown to Renai, is possessed too. In order to free Josh's soul and finally defeat the malevolent forces around them, Lorraine Lambert and her ghost-hunting friends investigate the past to save her family's future. Watch full movie and see what happened next. The fifth movie you should watch is Insidious the Red Door, released on 2023. This film is a sequel to the Insidious Chapter 2 and the last installment in the Insidious franchise. Ten years ago, Josh and Dalton are hypnotized to forget their astral voyage to the further. On the present days, Josh has divorced Renai and is estranged from his son. During the funeral of his mother Lorraine, 
Renai suggests Josh to drive Dalton to the university to reconnect with him during the journey. However, when they arrive at the dormitory, they have an argument and Josh returns home. Dalton is an arts student and his professor Armigan asks her students to go deeper in their inner fears and Dalton discovers a red door. Soon he is haunted by demons from the further. Watch full movie and see what happened next. Subscribe Harris Tomatic and hit the bell icon for more informative movie-related videos.